Hello, my Leo babies. Welcome back to Sold Out Tarot. This is going to be a general reading for July 26th through August 1st for anyone with Leo and their sun, moon, rising. Okay, so Leo, we'll start off with checking out the overall energy of this week. Okay, we have the star, the two of swords, and the page of pentacles in the reverse. The star, Aquarius energy, perfect for the Aquarius full moon, okay, that we just had here on the 23rd, I believe, 22nd. Um, but this is a time of healing, of hope, of renewal, okay? There is a choice here, okay? I am seeing there's some kind of decision that you're going to have to make, and it looks like, am I going to choose healing, There's some other situation here. Pa Page of Pentacles in the reverse. This is an impatient energy, okay? Not having everything you need to be successful. An immature energy. Also somebody that's like carrying resentment. Let's clarify this. Let's clarify the Two of Swords. Not this choice. Yeah, okay. This is going to be all about you guys making the choice, okay? To face your... The nightmare of the mind, your fears, your anxieties, okay? Managing your emotions, being codependent on somebody else. With the Page of Pentacles in the reverse here, this could definitely be talking about you relying on an outside source for stability, okay? And there's not a solid foundation, and you're being asked right now to go within. The Hermit is here, okay? Virgo energy, this is about connecting with ourselves so we can listen to our, intu excuse me, our intuition, going into solitude so we can hear our inner voice connect with ourselves so we can know what we're supposed to do next this is all about evolving spiritual growth okay a lot of you guys may not be sleeping at night really having trouble okay controlling your emotions tell me more about this page of pentacles in the reverse please spirit for our leos The Empress, Libra energy, King of Swords in the reverse, Five of Wands in the reverse. Okay. Somebody here doesn't want to fight anymore. They want to nurture this connection. Okay. But you guys are being blocked with this, okay? What you need to do is take this empress energy here, okay? This love, this motherly nurturing love and put it inwards, okay? Allow the empress and the star to work together. Let's take a look at your recent past. I feel like there's a lot of guilt in like fighting lately. The artist, queen of pentacles, ace of wands in the reverse. There was a passionate glimpse here of this is what I want to do. This is what is my purpose. The Queen of Pentacles, this is a very stable energy, okay? She gives her whole heart to everything, okay? She's abundant. She's multitasking. She's financially secure. She's motherly. She's nurturing, okay? The artist vessel of creation for the universe just by being present and being in alignment with who they are they create they co-create with spirit okay but the ace of wands in the reverse this beginning never took off delays obstacles unclear it was just so unclear what exactly is it that you're supposed to be doing or that you want and your current energy Eight of Cups in the reverse, Three of Pentacles, Queen of Swords in the reverse. With the Eight of Cups here in the reverse, somebody, you're walking away from something here. But you're very, um, it could be a trigger, okay? The Three of Pentacles, this is a collaboration, trying to work together, right? Create harmony, solutions. 
but there's a frustration here no connection some of it can be cruel yeah king of pentacles and the two of cups in the reverse somebody is very focused on i want to say abundance finances they're very they're being very logical right now and they're disconnected from themselves their emotions okay this connection there's a disconnection well in this connection anyway and the energy that's surrounding you let's take a look there there's a lot going on right now the sun leo energy king of wands the moon pisces energy okay so stuff in the subconscious yeah somebody is very passionate very 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 passionate and on their way to healing a rebirth the sun will illuminate everything the sun is here illuminating the shadow work okay and there's a king of wands energy right here in the middle they're ready they want to find their happiness and there is something preventing you from joining this person The King of Wands, he's very successful. He's mastered his skill. Very passionate, very sexual also. There could be a very like sexual energy between you and another person. There's this energy here of not trusting. And you're being asked if you're gonna take, I wanna say a leap of faith. The full card hasn't shown up yet, but with healing, with going within. This person might be able to help you. Let's clarify more here. The Queen of Wands is here. So this is a divine counterpart. Absolutely. If that wasn't obvious with the Two of Cups. Um, Queen of Wands, she's passionate. She's about personal growth. Again, gives her 110% to everything she does. She's also very in touch with her intuition her femininity, her creative side. Page of Wands in the reverse, it's like, well, these pages are blocked. Stagnant energy, no plan, unclear goals. Okay, you guys might have someone blocked or not talking to somebody. Five of Pentacles, it's like there's loss, poverty here. But it looks like they're going within to discover that. Let's see. Your advice going forward for this week. Seven of swords in the reverse. The ten of cups in the reverse. The well in reverse. You guys are ready to walk away. Destruction, endings, lack of connection, lack of harmony but not in i feel like you guys are just going with the flow like it feels right to not fight for this connection something is telling you guys to just stay isolated right now and it could have a lot to do with this past energy here a feeling like you found your purpose or your passion but it never got started hmm can we clarify the Seven of Swords in the reverse, please? Mm -hmm. There we go. Nine of Cups, Ten of Wands in reverse, Three of Wands in the reverse, okay? You guys are being asked to accept help. It could be, okay? The In the energy that's surrounding you, okay? A friend, a family member, a mentor, okay? But there's opportunity here for a new way of being, a new way of life, okay? Putting down the burden, there's too much pressure. It's time to find solutions, okay? You guys, um, it's like there's still indecision though. There's so much indecision. 
I'm going to go back here and clarify this Ace of Wands for you guys. In the reverse. What was the new start that never took off? The past. More Libra energy, justice, page of swords in the reverse. So we have three pages in the reverse. Eight of wands in the reverse. So much stagnant energy, so much exhaustion, overthinking, mistakes, confusion, finding truth in that. To sum up this reading for you guys, it's going to be a choice if you keep looking outside for distractions. It's like you guys are looking for new opportunities, but the only way through is through, right? It's going to be a choice. This is what it comes down to, the whole reading right here. Do you want the delays? I mean, you guys had three pages in reverse here. Do you want to keep experiencing this? Okay? Or do you want to go towards healing, growth? Let's take a look into some romance oracles for you this week. My Leo loves. It's going to be okay. Look got a tapestry to support us let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others okay there's somebody around you you guys okay gender it doesn't matter they have balanced both energies masculine and feminine for your creativity for personal growth retreat it's time to disconnect from the world mm -hmm. one more past life relationship you have known each other before okay so there could be some cycles playing out right now absolutely okay from our star seed oracles please spirit baby steps action follow your intuition before it makes sense that's right it's going to be a choice don't stick around for another block for another page in the reverse Follow your intuition. Go within. Do things differently this time. Star ancestors. Hidden secrets. Lost wisdom. Look a little deeper. A lot of you guys are going to find a lot of answers from your shadow. I did a shadow spread. It could be very beneficial to check that out for you. Star keeper. Cosmic ancestor. See the light by staying grounded. Controlling our emotions, okay? That's what I have for you this week, Leo. I hope that was helpful. If any of you would like a fuller, more descriptive reading, that information's in the box below. Give this video a thumbs up. Say hey to me in the comments. Hit that subscribe button. But most of all, be kind. I love you. Bye.